Hey folks, I'm Trevain Glory and welcome to part 52 of my adventure in Solasta, Crown of the Magister. So since the last time out, uh, I've not done too much. I took a short rest uh, to get Miriel's hit points back up and also she recovered a couple of spells. But we really are um, in need of a long rest. Kebra here in particular is pretty beat up, so I should probably give her a healing potion. I've got two greater there. You don't have any. You've got one greater and two superior. I don't want to have to keep revivifying her every time. Um... D4 plus 8. How many hit points does Kebra normally have? I can't remember. 52. Yes, so let's splash out, give her a superior potion. Right. You're in a bit better shape now, so let's push on further into this labyrinth. Cautious mode, uh, Miriel, yeah, getting the light cantrip up again. And off we go. So we fought uh, fire spiders in our last encounter. Actually, Eight elemental. Encountered that a long time ago. Don't even remember encountering the Archmage. Bird of flesh. We've re uh, fully um, identified now. Okay, but Crimson Spider. I'm no doubt we'll come up against some of these later on. We're going to find and kill the old queen who apparently is a Shelob type character. So, uh, we know that they're um, vulnerable to cold damage, such as in the Ray of Frost. Beastmasters, I should have done this off camera. Chieftain. Shaman, okay. The Pilgrim, this is what we fought a couple of episodes ago. 80 hit points, armor class 17, they are tough. And there was a bigger version as well. Fully aware of the Acolyte now. No vulnerabilities, just immunities and resistances. Okay, where was that? The Pilgrim. There was a much, much larger version. Unless the Pilgrim is the one that I had, uh, I was thinking about. But there was definitely two types of Beetle. Strange. All right, okay, never mind. Um, Hang on, no, it's on there for a reason. It was nothing to do with the beast theory. Can't remember why I was coming in here. Maybe it'll come back to me. Anyway, we carry on. More braziers over here that we can light. So I'll then wait you get the torch back out. Uh oh. We need light. It's an <laughs> super big deep spider. This is insane. Let's go back. Good idea. I'd rather kill all the orcs in that damn volcano than walk down this spider pit in the pitch dark. There has to be a way. Yes, there is. 
Uh, uh, okay, everyone come back here a bit. And then let's have then we Galathil come forward, you a bit further forward. Kebra, can you cast your Ah no balls right um and you didn't repair that daylight, did you? No. Shine isn't going to cut it. Right, okay, we need to withdraw. Yeah, thankfully we didn't trigger any alerts there. And we're going to head back. I need to go and take a long rest. Uh, fast travel, yeah. We cannot fast travel. The path is blocked. Jeez Louise. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Where do we go from here? Everybody, I don't know why you went to that. It was over this direction. Can we not get back out? You've sealed the exit behind us. That's not good. Spiderlings. What do you mean they've sealed the route? How can they seal the damn route? Was it through here? No. That was it. That was the entrance. Right, well, we're going to have to go and kill these spiderlings then. Uh, just... Uh, so who's got a crossbow equipped? You... Attack. Uh, we're up there. No, we don't want the Spider Queen. Perhaps if you try to be loud instead. Yeah, try to be loud instead. You come up here for now. And end your turn. Holy crap. I. Uh, you just come up there. Attack. And a re-attack. And you turn. Galathil, yeah, you come up to here. You'll need to do better than that. One more. Uh, okay, two more. Do you there? And who have we got now? Miriel, you actually want you in there. But head up to there for now. And yeah, try a firebolt. Why can you not see it? Oh, it's behind uh, a wall. Okay, well in that case, just dash in there. Very slow dash. Kebra, you dash as well. Just notice the Spider Queen has 150 hit points. go and you can see something you can apparently shoot this with a disadvantage don't do that just ready an attack ready your cantrip I really thought I never mind Oof. Thank goodness for disadvantage. What did they... Did you not kill that one? Is it more? We killed one. Where's the... Right. 
Fine. Uh, try and kill this one first. Oh dear. Yeah, keep the torch. Sorry for that long pause. I was wondering whether I should get rid of the torch and get the shield, but the torch is probably what's given them disadvantage. Right, Galathil. Kill. Oh, come on, kill it. I was going to cast Hunter's Mark, but that was more important, I think. And now... Meryl... You used to have light coming from your staff. Let's go for maximum effort with magic missile. Okay, but what you've got for is no use, not much use. Well, dark vision, calm emotions. Bless. Do you want to go for bless just now? Let's go with a shocking grasp. That was less than impressive. Okay, Orphan, uh, let's have some spirit guardians here. Where is your light spell? Um, yeah, Spirit Guardians. Proceed. And end your turn. Kebra is going to have to survive for the hit points that she has at the moment. It's only got five hit points left. You can't attack anybody else. So that'll do. Elaine Wing Galath will pass. That's One Kebra. Nice. Right. Uh, yeah, so. On to the next. Yeah. Spiderlings in no big thing. Bravo. Ooh, is it out of sight? I think it is. Oh no, it's not. Right, Galathil, you get up there and attack. Again, harder. And go with the hunter's mark because no doubt I'm going to need it. Against the Spider Queen. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, I distracted you by making you cast a spell. Muriel. Real Frost, or. Imagine they're not the wisest of things. Okay. Better than nothing. The real frost. Oh, well, you're not very good with the real frost, Kebra, are you? I need somebody else to get a torch. And, well, does Miriel's uh, staff cast enough light? I do not know. Um, for now, 
Let me switch over to that. Come on, you oh, can do better. Oh, no, I just thought of something. Attacks against Galathil that it... No, against him at a disadvantage. No, that's okay. Right. Focus on killing the spiderlings first. You'll die like the rest. As if to prove her point. Right. Yes, yeah, so the light is causing disadvantage. Light sensitivity, yes. Right. Uh Galithil. There we go. And then you come back to here. Switch target to Biggin. And no, that's your turn. Miriel. You jump up there. And I don't think Lightning Bolt would. No, no, it, it, no, it's not. I don't know. Is it going to get it? I don't want to risk uh, blasting it off that wall. Try something different. I think for now, we're going to go with Flaming Sphere. Cast it. Yeah, let's just cast it there. That'll do for now. The Flaming Sphere, make an attack. Okay. Now... Try Acid Arrow. Hoping for a vulnerability. But... No. Are you okay? Right, okay, I think we're okay to leave Elaine Bloody hell. I'll leave Elaine with her torch. What can you give us? You don't actually have much. Guiding bolt, I would rather you have that, so switch over to that drop the shield, get the guiding bolt. We bring light and dark. Don't miss. You missed with a one. Oh my god. Okay, I. Uh, Uh, where's your use your power? And good attack, and another, and action surge. Uh, nice come move. on, give us a fourth hit. Yeah. Lovely. Don't kill anybody. Nice. Okay. Kill a cell. You don't have any spells really other than Hunter's Mark, so just three attacks here. Try and hit with at least two of them. Or one. Or none. Three, four, five. Miriel, get the flaming sphere to attack it from behind. And... I 
I should maybe have cast black tentacles on it when it was back here. Is it going to be resistant to necrotic damage? Don't know. We're going to try it anyway. Succeeded its con save, which is a pain in the ass. Kebra, we need something big from you. But that's what you don't have. Healing, probably not that necessary. What I'm thinking about is. No, not aid. Uh, I was thinking about um, bless, actually. Hideous laughter. Yeah, we'll go with bless on the front three. Go. Flaming Sphere is doing worse. good work for us. Inflict Wounds is probably better. So we'll try that. Oh, you rolled it. You missed. Did you have... Uh, yeah, light sensitivity as well. Okay. Right. And then we finish it. No ah, there we go. Who needs a long rest? I promise I'll never scoff again at anything is possible in the Badlands. At least we got it. Well, hopefully that means another Orc tribe behind us. You really want to give up this axe? Look at it. It's a masterpiece. Tamarian smiths were just as good as the elves of Manigallon. This axe is fantastic. I say we keep it. The gem's more important. And to get that, we need to give the axe to Bladefang. And also, nobody uses an axe anyway. I wasn't expecting that to be quite as quick. I thought I was going to have to go further into the sort of labyrinth. Never mind. Uh, let's have everyone group up again. I'm going to keep spirit guardians up, but the flaming sphere we don't need. I just want to have a look around, essentially, and see if there's any more loot to be had. Did we, we did pick up that axe, didn't we? Yes, I just noticed it in the um, the log. Yep. D12 plus 3. Very nice. I was thinking at one point about having Galathil with a sword and an axe, and he's got his plus 1 hand axe. So, I should really have everyone coming over here. It doesn't seem like there's any more loot around, which is a bit of a pain. I suppose we get almost 1500 uh, experience. What's this about here? Huh. Uh, that's just to get up to the primordial lava stones. I underestimated you. My apologies. Okay. So yeah, I don't see any more loot anywhere around. Other than there, where did that come from? Spider Queen Venom. Ah, it's an ingredient for some magic weapon or such like. Uh, 
Right, so can we now fast travel back here? Yes, we can. And we head back to the whatever tribe it was, forgotten. Given uh, we have to go and return the axe, hopefully we'll then be able to get a long rest before I head out on the next quest. The next one being something about elves, elven knowledge. Where do I want to be? I've forgotten. Uh, which one? Show me. We found item Radolf wanted. Return to the blade furring tribe. Okay. That's this one here then. Yes, recognize it now. Greetings, uh, Radolf, or whatever your name is. I mean no disrespect. Back with Nyarks. Have the... Here, your ex. Here it is. Your holy axe. I knew it was real. It is magnificent. Nice vocabulary. You made Blade Fang more powerful than ever. Mm -hmm. We follow you. Good stuff. Arok. Good choice. Alright. Um, so close now to next level. And we can take a long rest, so that is exactly what I'm going to do. Uh, yes, we shall wait. And... Yeah, good stuff. Preparing spells. Orofin. It's probably too late now. But I think I should take a uh, daylight. Shield of Faith. Inflict wounds. I know that I used it. Trying to use it last time out, but I don't use it very often, so we'll do that instead. And I reckon we're just going to keep you as you are. Wall of Fire would be nice, but I like black, black tentacles. Uh, dexterity saving throws. No strength saving throw. Okay, it might be useful. I'm trying to remember what we're coming up against. Uh, there was talk of Sorakaths. I think that's us ready to go then. What I would like to do, check out crafting. Battle Axe of Acuteness, uh, that's the Queen, Spider Queen's Venom Gland. I was interested in seeing if I could use that uh, for anything. I'm not seeing the Primordial Lava Stones being useful for anything here either. No. All right, uh, are we crafting anything here? Basic poison bolt, dark stab. You start crafting that. You're already crafting the long night poisoned arrow. 
you can't craft anything. Right, okay. So... I don't think I've got anything really to sell. Can we read this? We can. Now these are ingredients. But we don't know what for. No, nothing to sell, I suppose. Let's move on. And actually, it's time to put in a break. So let's return to the crossroads. And then is it into the burrows? Is that what we're to do? No. Go through Red Scar Gate. Explore the Necropolis. Is that the Red Scar Gate? No, that's where we've just been. Okay, I'll need to figure out where the Red Scar Gate is then. Is it anywhere in here? No. Okay, but as I said, time to put in a break. It must be back. There it is. Uh, yeah, so I'll put in a break and we will go through the Red Scar Gate next time out. So we can fast travel, but I presume we can get along here and down. Yeah, there's a pathway along there. Okay, so thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this. Please leave me a comment, rate the video, subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content and I hope to see you again next time. Cheers.